got here? Jeez. Out of nowhere, Kamashita's. I'm about to be ratted out since it started going off. Mishima, isn't it time for practice? Uh, I'm not feeling well today. What? Maybe you're better off quitting then. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from the school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? Spike. I personally believe this one's more of like a patronizing thing than a... I'm gonna use it. <laughs> Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. This won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. That asshole. He's gonna pay for this. There's no point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. The principal, our parents. They all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has gotta be a joke! Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you, of all people, know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. I'll try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's all I can do. hard to play the game when you don't have control anymore. Yeah. Alright, 
uh, slightly excited girl. I think I might ask for his autograph after school. Nervous room. I don't know if that's such a good idea. Or he shouldn't go anywhere. He shouldn't go near the PE faculty office. People say they can hear weird sounds like screaming even though no one's there. What? It's probably just a rumor spread by fans to scare the, to scare the competition. Someone who knows them. It's kind of like he's BFFs with a starter girl named Suzuki. I tried to talk to that girl during break, but I got nothing. That's why we should have Takamaki talk to her. Then again, I guess it'll be harder hard getting her to that. Sorry, let me see what else I can come up with. your eye. Is that from practice, too? Y yeah Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job. I should get going. Shiho. Are you sure you're okay? Uh huh. Yes. T today won't work. I'm. I'm not feeling so good. Sorry. Isn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Come on, dude. You can't go after Kamoshida's bitch. Spacing out. You don't look familiar. Can you be the transfer student from class D? Um, this might not be any of my business, but don't let the rumors get to you, okay? They don't bother me, because they're true. No. Okay. Well, dear. My best friend is often misunderstood, too. Well, because of rumors. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to drag on like that. Then I'll... Anyway, I have to go to practice. See you. kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. Kamoshida had to have told him something. At this rate, looks like we'll have to go to him directly. Should have started with that. There's no point. I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. 
Can you think of anything? Oh, God. So you want to tell them about the castle? They never believe us. Have any other ideas? Oh, that'd be fine if we could do it without getting caught, but if we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? What do we do? Let's punish the king. Let's punish the king. The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to... I finally found you! Okay. Forgot about you this. You say something? Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. That voice... Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day! The cat's talking? I am not a cat! This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our world? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? Hell, we're easy. You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. <laughs> He's like a cat with a cell phone, oh my god. <laughs> that aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this too? No, it's just you, Reed. You must be, you must be a Lucy. Meow. This is no time to be joking around! You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm. I heard you mention something about witnesses. Now oh, shut up! could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? God, quiet down! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? <sighs> Make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Does that mean only us two can understand what you're saying? Looks like it. What the hell's going on? Anyways, what you were talking about earlier, is it for real? You're quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be just small enough to fit. Hey, how dare you treat me like... Don't be so rough with me. Enough of that! You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So, if that castle were no more... Precisely. You sure pick up things fast. For real? He, he's gonna turn good? But is that really getting back at him? Erasing a palace essentially means forcing the owner to have a change of heart. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. 
Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes. And he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. Not only will we be able to bring Kamoshida down, but there won't even be a trace of our involvement. That's amazing! You are one incredible cat! True. Except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. Stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable secret plan, after all. If you want to help me out, I'll gladly teach you. What's your call? Alex running dry looking for witnesses. Guess we have no choice but to go along. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love, those sorts of things. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die! Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Hey, what do you think? way and this is what I get. It's not like anyone will ever find out. That's not the point. Technically not true. It's the whole uh, B sub, the sub story to this game. Set that if we just go around secretly doing whatever we want, we'd be no better than that effing Kamoshida. Uh, isn't this your only option? I'll come back later. Make sure you've made your decision by then. Man, we're getting all worked up for nothing. Damn it! I'll try and see if I can figure out another way. Come on, let's get out of here. I think once we get on in the party, uh, we'll be able to go to the uh, palace freely. Which we get because to do a lot of training. Suzuki girl. Looks like rumors are going around about her and Kamoshida. If they're true, it's no wonder I couldn't get her to talk. Still, something doesn't seem right. What do you mean? It's just impossible. I've known Kamaki and Suzuki since middle school. There's no way Kamoshida's their type, you know? Just gotta wonder, gotta wonder where the rumors came from. Well, whatever. I'll try asking around some more. Scared female students. Saw that new transfer student hanging out around the second little group. Two of them. Are, uh, two of them are so scary. Female student heading home. He doesn't look like the kind of guy who'd have a criminal record. Maybe he's one of those. You know, people in those accidents. Maybe he suddenly freaks out and attacks people. Oh, like that mental shutdown. Uh huh. I don't think so. He's just been coming to school. Actually, he's almost seems normal. And from what I hear, after you have a psychotic breakdown, you go brain dead and die right there. Don't wander around. Su Jin, student heading up. Sakamoto's been asking questions about the volleyball team. Just who does he think he is? Carefree Shujin student. The level team is never going to tell him the truth. Uh, never going to tell him anything. They're all completely loyal to Kamoshida. 
Well, if Kamashita likes them, the future is pretty much set. Of course. Of course they'd back. Speaking of which, I heard Kamashita's new favorite girl is one named Suzuki. Oh, the girl has chosen to be a regular. Uh, her face was also looked pretty bad. Bother getting all the dialogue, but place like nothing happened. Didn't you find out what caused the accident? Oh, yeah. We're working on working hard. There was a bus accident before just like this. Didn't you figure out how to prevent this already? I'm very sorry sir. It seems the conductor suddenly fell unconscious and then and then nothing. What? Hmm? Tired looking officer. worker. How can you think it's all a coincidence that the same thing keeps happening again and again? Office worker heading home. The train to the other day was horrific. If you ask me, it looked more like an act of terrorism. Maybe it's a conspiracy. Another country attacking us. You think they're using mind control? If it was mind control, they're messing it up. Those people end up going brain dead, don't they? To it. Wait, what? That's not what you promised. And you call yourself a teacher? This has nothing to do with Shiho. Uh, Shiho's starting position. Are you listening? <sighs> Haven't you heard of privacy? <sighs> no, I was out of line. Sorry. So, how much did you hear? See. Is true. It's nothing at all. Nothing. Down into the subway. Oh, no, I guess not. Um, up here? No. Yeah. Uh, down. Okay. 
shiz back here. So everyone who walks by me. Anything to talk about with you. It was just an argument. Thank you very much. You've heard the rumors, haven't you? About Mr. Kamoshida. Everyone says we're getting it on. But that's so not true. And that was him on the other line. I avoided giving him my number for the longest time. He told me to go to his place after this. You know what it means. If I turn him down, he said he'd take my friend off as a regular on the team. I've been telling myself this is all for Shiho's sake. I can't take it anymore. Uh, uh. I've had enough of this. I hate him. But still, she was my best friend. She's all I have left in that sorry excuse of a school. Tell me, what should I do? <laughs> sorry, I shouldn't have asked. It's not your problem. I barely even talked to you before. No, this was all my fault. You're so weird. Usually everyone just ignores me. Are you really a bad person, as the rumor says? You just don't seem like it. <laughs> um, say that. Uh, that you assaulted someone. That you almost killed them. Kinda had a feeling they were all just exaggerations. You seemed lonely. Almost like you didn't belong anywhere. You're the same in that regard. Maybe that's why it was so easy for me to talk to you. Is there really no way for me to help Shio? I wish he'd just change his mind. Like, forget about me and everything. As if something like that would ever happen. I wasn't asking for a serious response. But I do feel a bit better now. I'm gonna head home. <laughs> 